Today we're going to demonstrate CA Endeavor SCM's Bitbucket Enterprise Git Repository plugin, a component of the new Integrations for Enterprise DevOps option that allows developers to work in Git and have their changes synced up to Endeavor for build and lifecycle automation. Here we see we have a Bitbucket repository branch that's been initialized with the plugin and that contains COBOL and copybook files. Clicking on the configuration page, you can see that the plugin has added an Endeavor configuration section. And if we click over here, we can see that the branch has been mapped to an entry stage for a given system and subsystem. This means that any change being made in Git in that branch will automatically be synced into the entry stage in Endeavor. Multiple branches can be mapped as well. With the bridge, developers are free to use any IDE with a Git plugin. Here we're using Eclipse J to make a small change to our COBOL file. Once the change is saved, we'll commit the change to our local Git repository. Remember, Git is peer-to-peer, -peer, and to get changes into the enterprise repository, we'll have to finish up with a push to the remote repository we initially cloned from. Now that the push is complete, we can go to our Bitbucket repository and refresh, and we can see that our change is indeed there. And if we drill down into the file, we can see that, yes, the text that we put in the editor has propagated to the Enterprise Bitbucket repository. Checking our email, we can see a notification has arrived indicating that the change has been successfully synchronized to CA Endeavor SCM in the background. We can go and validate that by logging directly onto Endeavor on the mainframe and looking for our change. And there it is. We can see that the change has made it successfully to the mainframe from the Enterprise Git repository. That covers the simple use case, but what if there's two developers working on the same file and one's working in Endeavor and the other's working in Git? Let's go ahead and make a change directly in Endeavor. After making the change, we save and generate. And now we'll go back to our IDE and we'll go ahead and make a change on top of the previous change we made in Git. We make the change and save it. And remember, this is a conflicting change with the change that was made directly in Endeavor SCM. As before, we go to the Git terminal and we do a commit, followed by a push to the remote repository. And we flip over to Bitbucket and refresh, and you can see our change has been accepted. This time, however, when the change synchronizes to Endeavor, we can see that we get a notification about a revert. The bridge has detected the conflict and pulled the change that was made directly in Endeavor back into the Git repository. Looking in Bitbucket, if we refresh, we can see that the change is shown as reverted and refreshed. And if we look at the change detail, we can see that the change made directly in Endeavor has been propagated to the Git repository. The developer who made the change in the Git repository has their change still, but it's been pushed onto a branch. This allows the Git developer to merge his changes with the Endeavor developers without leaving the Git environment. This concludes our demonstration of the CA Endeavor SCM Bitbucket Enterprise Git repository plugin. Thank you.